Hello. This lighting is weird. You can see the shadow. So, hello guys. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I haven't posted a video in a very long time, but this upcoming semester I'm going to be studying abroad in Spain and I leave February 6th and I just moved into a new house back home. I've been going through clothes and so today I want to do a haul of clothes my mom has given me because I was going to make like a TikTok but there was so much stuff and I thought this would be the perfect time for me to get back onto YouTube and if it wasn't posted already, it's still going to be coming out with like a video of lost vlog footage. So yeah, because there's been a lot from over this year, but I'll just get right into the haul. I'm going to do a little bit at a time. Thumbnail. Wait. I'm going to do a little bit at a time because I just started to hang it all up. My room's already a mess. First thing is this blouse. The brand is Antonio Milani. It's extra small. Then next, she gave me this Ann Taylor blouse, which fits really nicely. Then, so she got this shirt in Paris. This, and the pattern's like really pretty. Focus. Yeah, you can see it. The pattern's super pretty. And then she really liked the cut of it, so she got this one made and this, like, based on this one. And this is also a pretty print. And this brand is AC Collection Paris. In a size one. This one is Tahari. It's like a button down vest, kind of like a waistcoat because it has this tie in the back. But that was really cute. Then she gave me this corset. The brand is Lily Rubin, it's a size four. And it has like really pretty lace on it. And then the really dainty like sleeves. And it's kind of big on me. I'm gonna wear it anyways. Then I have this Ann Taylor plaid top. And she has a lot of tops that fit really nice where they like zip so they fit really snug. And I thought this would be really cute when I'm abroad, like layering it with sweaters. Okay, so next, give me a bunch of halter tops. Also this shirt I'm wearing, and it's Ralph Lauren, and it has like a little cute little polo thing. I really like it, but this one, Charlotte Russe. She has a lot of ones that were Charlotte Russe, but I'll hold up. It's like a halter top, and it's mesh, and it's so cute, and like flares, cutouts at the side. Maybe she just got it taken in, I don't really know. But yeah, that one. Then this mesh Charlotte Russe top, which is my favorite one so far. I tried it on, I was doing like a little fashion show yesterday for my fam. Then this halter top, she's had it for so long, I've always seen it and been like, it is from Loft, from Ann Taylor. Here's Ann Taylor's Fire. Then this halter top. The colors are beautiful, like paisley. I wanted to focus. Hello. It's focused now. It's so pretty. And this one is from J.M. Wallen. I don't know what that is. It has a really cute loop detail. And then it's halter top as well. She gave me this red theory tank top. That she said she wore with like a suit to a black tie event. And she had so many black tights. So I thought I would just take them all to make some fun like subversive basic tops okay Ooh. so now show you the dresses she gave me so first this one this one's from miss t by trina turk and i like the cut of the neck a lot and it's super flowy and short just fun by the beach my vision is in greece by the pool ideally so this one is from Tiana B and it's a sweater dress, turtleneck. Really cute because also you can fold it up, like you know, you can make it like shorter. So yeah, definitely gonna be wearing this a lot. I haven't been wanting to wear pants 
even though it's so cold. Like I've just been wearing really long sweaters and tights and dresses and tights. It's another good addition. Then we have this one. This one's so pretty and like delicate. It's from Loft and it's like tiered and it's just super dainty and pretty. I like that one a lot. Like a sundress that's black because people don't really wear as much like black in the summer. But I love wearing all black. So this dress is so beautiful. She's worn it a lot, but it's so pretty. This brand is Laundry by Shelly Siegel. It's just a strapless little dress. It's so cute. I'm gonna need it taken in. So hopefully it fits. The next like three, I guess, it's very Gossip Girl, Blair Waldorf, even like Monet DeHaan from the reboot, who I love. This one's from BB Dakota, but look at it. The color, I don't know how to say things. And it's short and it's really cute with like turtleneck under, long sleeve under for winter and it's super thick. Actually gonna be warm. Oh, and that one has pockets too. Weird angle, so I'm like sitting on my bed. So this one's from Free People. And this one's also really Blair Waldorf vibes, like with puff sleeve shirt underneath. That'd be so cute, especially if it was a long sleeve. But it has pockets, and then I like her drop waistline. Like the skirt itself is very short, it's not high waisted, so it's long torso and short skirt. Also perfect for winter and layering. Then, this one's one of my favorites. I tried it on with the outfit too yesterday, and it was just so cute. I was asking her if she had any little black dresses. And this one's from BCBG Max Azaria, or Max Azaria. And it's just a shift dress, and it's black with these leather pocket details. Pretty short on, and I tried it on with like a blazer and some boots, and it was so cute. So I'm excited for that. I love wearing all black, as I said before. But now, sweaters and the jackets. First, this is from Brooks Brothers, and it's like a French cuff, so there's no buttons and it flares. This is just like a plain white button down that's really tight and nicely fitted and she gave me two of them. And I love layering like preppy looks, so that'll be good. Then she gave me this seersucker blazer, I guess. And I feel like this would be really good for the summer. I'm definitely not taking it to Spain. Seersucker is not really winter material, but that one's really cute. She had two and I wanted this one because of how thin the stripes were. This Ann Taylor Loft jacket and it was very much like chanel tweed vibes and then the details has these cute little round pockets this belt and then cute buttons that is for them. then she gave me this jean jacket this one's from my aunt actually but i just want to show anyways and i just like small jackets like this that are very fitted and I just can't wait to find a pair of jeans that's the same color denim and then wearing them together it'll look really good. Then this white jean jacket was for my mom, which I was really excited about because like it's that fit, it's pretty tight. Ooh. What we have left is really an assortment of things. Okay, here's this belt. The first thing in this section is this belt and it's like a wrap belt show you how it looks on it's from guess and it's not really with this like outfit but i think it'd look really cute over like a mini dress and like go go boots like very sharon tate for belts if i'm gonna have any belts i like huge statement ones so i really like that this skirt is tiny it's really like high waisted i guess to the smallest part of my waist but it's so tiny i tried it on and it did not zip all the way up but super cute metallic -y blue to the shimmer. That's really cute skirt. And it was made by someone actually in Cleveland. And then this J. Crew skirt. And it's super cute. It goes kind of straight down and then pleats more at the bottom. Velvet ribbon as a belt. And then it also has a matching blazer, which I don't have here, but she gave me the blazer as well. This Ralph Lauren cashmere turtleneck and it's really warm oh my gosh speaking of warm it's hot af in my room right now but it's really nice and tight and i like how it's like an eggplant 
purple color. I love wearing black and white, but then sometimes I get so in that. Wearing my like tan, brown, black, white, I don't want to wear color. So that's a good thing for me to have. Then two of these sleeveless turtlenecks from Loft, I think. Yeah, Ann Taylor Loft, an extra small. And that's so cute. And I'm so excited. I really wanted to find ones like this just to wear with like a black skirt and knee high boots. She gave me the same one in tan, which is a really pretty color. Good for layering, good for Spain being abroad. And then I have this J. Crew. Is that a small? It's just like a cardigan. And I really like the cut of it and I like the round collar. It's very preppy, but I think it's just so cute and dainty. And then finally, I think this is it. No, she gave me shoes too. Okay. Is this scarf. And it's so nice. Warm. Oh, my hair. And I like scarves that are huge or like tiny thin ones that do nothing and I just for an accessory, no in between. That's what I like. So let me get the shoes. These shoes, the little wedges and they're silver and then the back is open and so her feet are smaller than mine. But because of that, these fit me and I was really excited. She said they're not practical for going abroad. Ooh, and they're from Coach. Also, oh, there's so much stuff away. So anyways, the last few things I wanted to share. Yeah, so these leg warmers, they're so fun. They give me like Missoni vibes. These are from H-U-G-R-Z, her huggers. I don't know. And she gave me these leg warmers as well, holes in them, and I also put them on my arms and they can be like sleeves, subversive basic. Finally, so I'm gonna borrow it for the trip, but this silver monogram print Gucci bag, it was like short, so it's like, and it's not really a shoulder bag, but I think I'm gonna get a strap, so it's crossbody. This one is so pretty. I think this was my aunt's too. But the inside print is really pretty as well. It was like in Spain like a long time ago with my aunt. She was carrying it and she fluffed in it. That was from Spain. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. I'm too sexy for this cell. Too sexy for your girl. Too sexy for this world. Too sexy for this. That's my haul. Thank you for watching. I'm going to definitely be way more active when I'm in Spain and vlogging and such. I'm still not going to have like a consistent posting schedule because I really just like to make YouTube videos for fun and for myself. And it would make me really stressed out, come up with new content just for the sake of it without actually having good content, if that makes sense. Thank you for watching my video. Wait, look how cool these pants are. So bedazzled. Thanks for watching my video. Stay tuned for that montage of lost vlog footage. And yeah, I think that's about it. Bye.